Sequential convex programming based distributed approaches have been the recent state of the art for corridor swarm motion planning. However, these approaches struggle in highly cluttered configurations as they rely on conservative approximations. First, linearization of non convex collision constraints to obtain affine hyperplane constraints. Second, axis wise decoupling of kinematic bounds to obtain affine box constraints. Such approximations are made to obtain a quadratic program at the expense of small feasible sets. We compare two variants of SCP. SCP continuous enforces hyperplane constraints over the entire horizon. SCP on demand enforces hyperplane constraints only to resolve the first predicted collision. Here we see that the SCP variance trade off interagent clearance with the compute time. Our alternating minimization based approach avoids previously mentioned approximations and still obtains a QP form. Approach completes the task with lower compute time, lower mission time, and comparable interagent clearance. Swarm demonstration 1. Here we see 12 quadrotors navigating to the desired goal locations smoothly while avoiding collisions. Swarm demonstration 2. Now the quadrotors navigate in an obstacle rich environment. Our approach can generate safety behaviors via discrete time barrier function constraints. Here, we see that chord orders with a lower gamma value show a safer collision avoidance behavior. Swarm demonstration 3. In this scenario, 12 chord orders make a rectangle formation. Again, chord orders with lower gamma value show a safer collision avoidance behavior. Swarm demonstration 4. In this scenario, 8 chord rotors operate in a shared workspace with a human. Each chord rotor has access to the instantaneous position and velocity information of the human and assumes a constant velocity prediction while optimizing their trajectories. Using barrier function constraints, the chord rotors can easily navigate around the human.